I just woke up. I think today's Thursday. We're watching The Martian on TV. It is about 8.30 in the morning. And at 9, Derek and I have a massage, which I'm really excited about. I've never really had a massage before, so that's going to be fun. And uh, we are on our way back to San Diego. We are just curling around the peninsula that we were in in Mexico. I think it'll take us like a day or two to get home. Um, officially, today is pajama day on the boat, so I'm just going to put on pajamas and walk around with those. So, uh, I kind of look like garbage, and I kind of feel a little... Um, and I just want to go home and shower and go back to my normal routine, but I fucking love this cruise, so I also don't want to get home. But breakfast arrived, so that's good. That's about it right now. I took some seasickness tablets just in case. Hey Derek, what, what happened? We just had a couple Louder. spots. We just had a couple spots. Uh huh. Yeah. And they used super hot rocks and oily hands and rubbed us all over our backs and legs and hands and bottoms of feet. And it was really good. Uh -huh. We're all chill now. Yep. And now we're gonna go see the double clicks. Uh -huh. Before we go to the concert, in our welcome packages when we first got on the into our room, they had a little bag with this stuff in it. Um, yep, there's a Lego piece. Oh, I think this is one of the ones that we're looking for. And puzzle pieces. And there's a Lego and puzzle room on the ship where everybody can come together and everybody has like one piece of the puzzle. So they're hoping people will come together and make it. And there's a current team that is very energetic about it so we're gonna go deliver our pieces so they can use them and make them happy hopefully so that's what we're doing look it's Derek Hello. I like to wear sweaters and skirts too I like to do just what I want to and if you don't like what I do with my life well that's great because I didn't ask you this is my jam this is my jam this is my toast this is my knife and this is my jam this is my jam this is my jam, this is my song, this is my life, and this is my jam. sounds like complete garbage and now I can try learning the song that is taped to the top of my ukulele and I don't remember what the song goes like I know the words I just don't know the song part so well, we'll see if we can learn a song
little sleepy. We had to get up early for our spa. How do you like it? Uh, the spa? Uh, well, it was, it was the parts where she wasn't talking to me about like how I was, it was all in my head and my stress was just there and all my problems were because I wasn't detoxing. Uh, the parts that weren't that were pretty good. So you liked it? Would sure. you recommend it? Maybe. It, I mean, it was fairly expensive. It was nice to have someone rubbing on you, but a little 50 50 is what I would say. How would you describe the con so far for you? Uh, I mean, it's been fun. We've been running around trying to help as best we can. Uh, it's a little bit chaotic when we don't necessarily know uh, when we're needed or everything that's happening. But we've been trying to fill in where we can. I like the boat and the water. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's really great to be on the water because it's just nice and peaceful and then you kind of look out in your balcony. Almost right. It's a little bit weird. Like it's not that as tangy. Good. It's not as tangy as it. Like I don't know. It's a some sort of brandy cocktail sauce. So we're getting closer to shrimp cocktail, hey. but not quite. is going really well. I have to bow out early because I have to go and teach people how to play um, Fuse in a sec. But Derek's very happy because like a ton of people showed up. The game max is at 20, Min's at 8. He's only ever run it at 8 and um, 17 people showed up so he's really chuffed. It's going really well. It's gonna end super soon which is really exciting. Today's towel creation is a doggy. Look it's so cute. Hello babe. Hi. I am the cameraman. It is my vlog. I have taken over. This is Derek's exciting adventures. Look at how excited I am. Was that good? Mm, really that, good. Was uh, that good branding? That is on point. Very okay. good footage. Good content. Fair. Great. I love it. So, I ran uh, Sarai, right? Sarai is what you're asking me about? So, we ran Sarai. And it went well because it ended in a complete bloodbath, which is always the best way. And several people betrayed and backstabbed each other. And then as we were walking around the ship a little bit afterward, we heard some of the players still talking about the game and what had happened and telling their friends about it. So I think that it went very successfully. That's how I would describe it. I do too. I'm very proud of you. I think you did a really good job. I didn't have to do a whole lot because we had enough players that they kind of instigated their own problems. Normally I have to run around being like the muckraking press who's like, Oh, did you hear about this scandal? And instead I was just like, Oh, sure, fine. You guys can just stab the shit out of each other. Yay! And then what happened? And uh, then, well, like what happened with our evening? Because they haven't really heard from me. Sure. Uh, well, we... I ran off to teach people how to play Fuse. Yep. Yeah. So, well, we had, a, we had a meeting about pack out, and then we had to leave that early to set up Sarai, and then we had to scrounge up players. I don't know if you talked told them about how... I did. You had to run... Okay, so you did that. And then we scrounged up players, and then we played Sarai, and then you ran off to run Fuse. And then I came to meet you after I had packed up and reset the room. Nope. What? We didn't go back to the room yet. No, uh, reset the Sarai room. Oh, I didn't do that. I know. Uh, I did that. Uh, so then I met you for Fuse, and what did we do then? We went stargazing. Oh, that's right. We went stargazing, and we saw the stars. 
Yeah, so on the upper, uh, on deck 10, which is the observation deck, which is outside, uh, they kindly turn off the lights super late at night so that you can go stargazing. It's only for like two or three hours, but we saw the plow and Orion's belt and then probably some more she planets means, and she stuff, means but big, we don't know what the planets are. She means the Big Dipper. And then that was really cold, so we only did that for like 15 minutes, so we went back to the room ordered some room service and we watched the Martian movie and then we packed our bags because tomorrow is our last day here and the day after we arrive in port at like 9 a.m. and there is a structure as to how you get off the boat and stuff like that so we were packing our bags today so we would be ready for that so tomorrow's our last full day at sea and it's a little sad it's very sad I don't think I'm ready yet to give my final conclusions of this convention. I think I'm going to leave that for tomorrow, the day after. I love you. I love you guys. Good night.